So just giving a shout out to Haley here, who really has been working our swing a lot lately, coming in about once a week, um, working at home, definitely using a Louisville Slugger RXT that she switched to um, just as of Christmas she got. So great bat. Um, but her, her work ethic has been awesome so far. So very proud of her for this. So we've really been working on keeping posture, keeping that bat over her head, knob to catcher's feet. Um, really starting to try to get her to transfer her weight, open up her hips, getting in a better sequence with her hands being back as her front foot is going forward all the way till heel plant. So what I mean by that is show you this in uh, real time here. So what I mean <clears throat> is this position, holding this position. So she is starting taller. I have a really starting tall. I really want her to sink into her legs because she used to start really wide and already be all bent. So she didn't really know how to get into her legs very well. So one thing that she does starts taller, really sinks into her back leg as the windup's coming. And then as she starts going forward, she's leaving her, walking away from her hands, creating separation as her front foot's coming forward. That's one thing that a lot of kids struggle with. We worked on it a lot, getting a better sequence. And then holding this position, bat over her head, not to catch her feet, all the way to heel plant. And then she turns her barrels, or we call seesaw the elbows, and drive that ball. Right? And using her hips correctly. Getting more firm in her front side, driving that heel in, and getting the hips going first. Creating a ton of bat speed behind her, driving that ball up. Keeping that back knee bent, staying tall, finishing tall in her upper body, and just driving that ball. So here's one more time so you can see it in real time how she's changed her swing. And just killing the ball here. So proud of her. Great job. Check it out.